Hello everyone, welcome to NCX Maths and today in this video we are going to discuss on principle of mathematical induction. So basically we are going to discuss on what is the principle of mathematical induction and how it works and also we will use it to prove the sum of first and natural numbers is n n plus 1 by 2 that is 1 plus 2 plus 3 plus dot dot, dot n is equals to n n plus 1 by 2 and before we begin, please consider subscribing to my channel and turn on notification bell for more higher mathematics related videos. So first, let's discuss on principle of mathematical induction. So, we use principle of mathematical induction to prove some mathematical theorems or facts. And to use this principle, first we suppose the statement to be PN, which we need to prove, where N is any natural number. And then first we show that P1 is true. That means we prove the fact is true for n equals to 1. And after this, we suppose that the statement is true for n equals to k. That is, we suppose that pk is true. And then we'll show pk plus 1 is also true. That is, we'll show that the theorem or the fact is also true for n equals to k plus 1. And this proves that pn is true for all n and in this way the given fact or theorem will be proved. So now I'm going to prove the fact that we have mentioned earlier by using mathematical induction. So first we suppose the statement which we need to prove that is 1 plus 2 plus 3 plus dot dot, dot n equals to n n plus 1 by 2. We suppose this to be pn. So we have supposed this statement to be pn and then first we show that p1 is true so that means we are going to prove the theorem for n equals to 1 so for n equal to 1 so in the left hand side n equal to 1 represents the first term and which is 1 so we got left hand side 1 and similarly on the right hand side we have n n plus 1 by 2 so as we put n equal to 1 we get 1, 1 plus 1 by 2 and which is 1. So we got 1 equals to 1. So this proves that P1 is true. And next we suppose that PK is true. So that means we suppose the theorem is true for N equals to K. So we can write down that. So we can write 1 plus 2 plus 3 plus dot dot, dot K is equal to K, K plus 1 by 2. And we have to prove that pk plus 1 is true. So this means we have to prove that 1 plus 2 plus 3 plus 4 plus dot 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 k and then k plus 1 equals to k plus 1 k plus 1 plus 1 by 2. So that is we have to prove the same fact the same fact but in place of n there we have k plus 1. So we have to prove this fact so to prove this we are going to start from the left hand side that is 1 plus 2 plus 3 plus up to k plus 1. So we are going to start from here and we have already supposed that 1 plus 2 plus 3 plus 4 plus up to k is k k plus 1 by 2. So there you can see that we have already supposed this fact that 1 plus 2 plus up to k is equal to k, k plus 1 by 2. So we can write this value k, k plus 1 by 2 and then plus k plus 1. So from these two terms we can take k plus 1 as common. So we have taken k plus 1 common. So we have k by 2 plus 1 and as you simplify this we get k plus 1 and then k plus 2 by 2 and we can write it as k plus 1 k plus 2 so instead of k plus 2 we can write k plus 1 plus 1 by 2 so we see that 1 plus 2 plus 3 plus up to k k plus 1 is equal to k plus 1 k plus 1 plus 1 by 2. So this is the same statement which we have to prove and now it is proved for n equals to k plus 1. 
so this means p k plus 1 is also true so we can say that by using mathematical induction p n is true for all natural number n so that means 1 plus 2 plus 3 plus up to n is equal to n n plus 1 by 2 so this proves the given fact so guys i hope you find this video useful and if you still have some confusion please comment down below and please don't forget to like this video and to subscribe my channel and turn on notification for more higher mathematics related videos thanks for watching have a nice time